Chapter 5 Tools 5.1 Tool Support Performance testing tools include the following types of tool to support performance testing. Load Generators The generator through an IDE, script editor, or tool suit is able to create and execute multiple client instances that simulate user behavior according to a defined operational profile. Creating multiple instances in short periods of time will cause load on a system under test. The generator creates the load and also collects metrics for later reporting. When executing performance tests, the objective of the load generator is to mimic the real world as much as is practical. This often means that user requests coming from various locations are needed, not just from the testing location. Environments that are set up with multiple points of presence will distribute where the load is originating from, so that it is not all coming from a single network. This provides realism to the test, though it can sometimes skew results if intermediate network hops create delays. Load Management Console the load management console provides the control to start and stop the load generators. The console also aggregates metrics from the various transactions that are defined within the load instances used by the generator. The console enables reports and graphs from the test executions to be viewed and supports results analysis. Monitoring tools Monitoring tools run concurrently with the component or system under test and supervise, record, and or analyze the behavior of the component or system. Typical components which are monitored include web server queues, system memory, and disk space. Monitoring tools can effectively support the root cause analysis of performance degradation in a system under test and may also be used to monitor a production environment when the product is released. During performance test execution, monitors may also be used on the load generator itself. License models for performance test tools include the traditional SEAT or SITE based license with full ownership, a cloud-based pay-as-you-go license model, and open source licenses which are free to use in a defined environment or through cloud-based offerings. Each model implies a different cost structure and may include ongoing maintenance. What is clear is that for any tool selected, understanding how that tool works through training and or self-study will require time and budget. 5.2 Tool Suitability the following factors should be considered when selecting a performance testing tool. Compatibility In general, a tool is selected for the organization and not only for a project. This means considering the following factors in the organization. Protocols As described in section 4.2.1, protocols are a very important aspect to perform tool selection. Understanding which protocols a system uses and which of these will be tested will provide necessary information in order to evaluate the appropriate test tool. Interfaces to external components Interfaces to software components or other tools may need to be considered as part of the complete integration requirements to meet process or other interoperability requirements, e.g. integration in the CI process. Platforms Compatibility with the platforms and their versions within an organization is essential. This applies to the platforms used to host the tools and the platforms with which the tools interact for monitoring and or load generation. Scalability Another factor to consider is the total number of concurrent user simulations the tool can handle. This will include several factors. Maximum number of licenses required Load generation workstation or server configuration requirements Ability to generate load 
from multiple points of presence, e.g. distributed servers. Understandability Another factor to consider is the level of technical knowledge needed to use the tool. This is often overlooked and can lead to unskilled testers incorrectly configuring tests, which in turn provide inaccurate results. For testing requiring complex scenarios and a high level of programmability and customization, teams should ensure that the tester has the necessary skills, background, and training. Monitoring Is the monitoring provided by the tool sufficient? Are there other monitoring tools available in the environment that can be used to supplement the monitoring by the tool? Can the monitoring be correlated to the defined transactions? All of these questions must be answered to determine if the tool will provide the monitoring required by the project. When monitoring is a separate program or tools or whole stack, then it can be used to monitor production environment when the product is released. Chapter 5 ends. ISTQB Performance Testing Syllabus ends.